We're working on balancing today. So what I have is magnesium in its solid form plus oxygen in its gas form, and that's gonna yield or make magnesium oxide, and that's a solid. So this is our equation sentence, which is our equation reaction. And it's important to note that O2, when it's in its gas form, is always with its twin, diatomic, two atoms. Okay. So if oxygen is by itself, you are gonna see a and you see a gas, then you better make sure that you have two oxygens. This works for all of the Brinkelhoffs, all of the diatomics. When you do your chart, we have magnesium and oxygen are the only two elements. We have reactants, which are ingredients. Products are what we're putting together. There's one magnesium on the left, two oxygens on the left, Remember that two refers to the oxygen. There's one magnesium on the right and one oxygen on the right. So we're not balanced. So we do not meet conservation of mass. Where it says that matter cannot be created nor destroyed. We have to balance it every time. Never leave an equation unbalanced because it won't meet conservation of mass. You won't get credit unless it's balanced. So it seems like I need to have two more oxygens on the right side. Okay. So I can't change the subscripts because if I make it MgO2, then my formula doesn't balance. So you can't change your formulas at this point. You only change your subs or coefficients, only change your coefficients. So that means I need to put a two in front of the M, G, and O. As soon as you change a coefficient, go back and change your chart. I now have two magnesiums and two oxygens, because remember, it's like we distribute. Well, I got partway there. Now I have two oxygens, but now I'm off track on my magnesium. So I have to go back and I need two magnesiums. So I'm gonna put a two in front of there. And now I have two magnesiums and two oxygens, and I'm gonna add in my implied one oxygen there so I can get a clear statement. So now I have two magnesium solids plus one oxygen gas yields two magnesium oxide solids. And that is what your equation is going to be. For this unit, you have to show your chart that's how you get your work for partial credit.